Apple TV and MLS season pass. And right off the bat, the fire picking up right where they left off. It's Chris Mueller. Oh, what a start to the second half. And what a finish from the Shelburne native. It's a two goal lead for the fire. Hernandez with a decent save. And then Yule finding Chris Mueller, who scores on his international debut. That ball, what are the key things about that pass? No, uh, not the ball yet, the ball that gives, why? Preferably, right? Okay. It's easier to time our runs in the box if that ball's passed soft and I, and I have him come into it and he's able, especially as you get older, you're gonna really bend that ball, right? You're gonna bend it and cause a lot of problems for the goalie and the center backs. Right? So that is definitely, and you see it a lot, right? That reverse ball and bent in the box and guys know when to make that movement and you see a lot of great goals scored that way. Just like you see a lot of great goals when someone gets to the end line. You kind of know what you're going to do when you get to the end line. You're either going to lift it, you're going to chop it, or you're going to zing it across the goal mouth. This is this preparation area so we don't necessarily see guys doing a good enough job and there's angles right if I were you I would be a little deeper you mentioned him earlier what has allowed Christopher Mueller to really take that jump this season to the next level and become statistically one of the best players in the country you know Chris uh, Chris was a 17 year old freshman um, he's young uh, when he when he started here and we felt he was a special player it's taken some time. He's hit a late growth spurt, and uh, you know I think we've helped him mature both on and off the field, and that's a big part of it. Um, we always felt that what we're seeing today and what other schools are talking and saying about him, we knew it was in him. Um, it's just come out now in, in true production. And you know his running mate Tommy Barlow does so many things to help Chris be successful, and then our midfield behind those guys. But we're giving the ball to Chris in good spots and. You know, he, he's just got some really great traits as a player. I've had a lot of professional coaches and scouts calling me about where they see him in a couple of years. And we're, we're just excited for him as well as the rest of the members of the team.